This week on TQA Weekly, I talk about typing faster. If ever you wanted to learn how to type faster, this is the episode that you should listen to. My name is Steve Smith. This is TQA Weekly, the place where I answer all your questions, comments, suggestions, and our PC horror stories. If you have any of your own, ask at tqaweekly.com is my email, tqaweekly.com is my website, and you can always use the comments box on this page. And of course, you're on YouTube and you don't like using it, don't. You can always find me on Twitter at, at @zaxis, or you can always find me on Facebook as well. Now today's topic is all about learning to type faster. But this episode is brought to you by ProXPN. ProXPN is a virtual private network that allows you to use the internet the way it should be, anonymously and without oversight. For 20% off your new account, go to proxpn.com slash podcasts and use the coupon code TQAWEE. This helps out the show a lot, and I promise they won't force Google Plus down your throat. So let's talk about typing faster. A lot of you that will be asking, how is it that we type faster than you? Probably don't know how to touch type. Touch typing is a attainable, learnable skill that does not come natively to the human genome. Obviously, we are not born with keyboards in our hands. Therefore, it is impossible that any of us have a more gifted approach to it than anybody else. So basically, it comes down to you need to learn the keyboard. But how? So for the first step at typing faster in today's episode, I've got two tools you can use. I'm going to really massacre the name, but I call it Keeper.com. I use it for the hell of it since I already type plenty fast, 100 plus words per minute. But you go to K-E-Y-B-R.com. This is for your normal person who's not part of a class or anything who wants to learn to type. Upon logging in, or logging in, loading the web page, you'll be greeted with a keyboard with plenty of color on it and a pause screen. Click to unpause and just type out the text. It'll give you total speed, average speed, total progress, and time spent. Now, obviously, you can log in and start practicing and having all your, of your time trials recorded for Prosperity to help you out. They boast that anybody to learn, using this tool that wants to learn to type, that practices 30 to 60 minutes per day for two whole weeks will actually learn how to type 50 words per minute two times faster than most businesses minimum requirement speed. Now, obviously, there are going to be teachers out there, directors out there, schools for young students who may need to learn how to type faster. And the best tool for that is typingweb.com. They have over and let's get that specific number, 5 million students and 100,000 teachers. Absolutely free for schools to use. Unlimited students, unlimited teachers, unlimited classes, offers a student and a teacher login, and it will be absolutely free for life. All you need to do is to start logging in. This is a very cool tool available on the internet that allows you and your students to actually learn how to type faster and it is great for typists of all skill levels. So if you have students that already type faster than the rest of the class, they can continue going further. And this has entertaining typing games, typing tests, and free online typing certification. And like I said, this solution is actually perfect for those of you listening that are part of schools who want to offer students at least some sort of ability at typing faster, since that is an actual important skill for today's world. I started learning how to type faster around the age of 11, 12, and I went from typing minus 15 words per minute when I was 11 years old to being 32 and typing clear over 115 words per minute constantly at a normal pace, and I can burst beyond that. Now, I do cheat, and I'm obviously not stupid. I'm not gonna be holding out on any of you I'm going to help you out to go a step further. It's not enough to be able to type faster. You need to give yourself the ability to go even faster 
naturally by enhancing your skills by giving yourself the tools. So first of all, you need to learn how to sit. Sitting straight and allowing the keyboard to be no higher than 90 degrees for your arms allows you to type more easily. If your arms are closing within 90 degrees, which means your arm reaches your bicep with less than 90 degrees of angle, you are now actually straining your carpal tunnel. Wrist rests for keyboards are bogus since they will also injure your carpal tunnel. Injuring the carpal tunnel will make you type slower. And resting your wrist on anything does make you type slower and actually leads to repetitive stress injuries or RSIs. So I hope I don't need to keep repeating that part ever again. I've done it twice in my 160 shows. So we'll leave that alone. But the other way of typing faster is changing the keyboard. Not all people like typing on mesh keyboards and not all like all people like typing on mechanical keyboards. Now I use a Blackwood Ultimate 2013 keyboard. I change constantly my keyboard and I always go for the most comfortable feel, but I go for something mechanical. This is because I only need to press a certain amount, a certain distance, and I have a click that I can also hear and feel that tells me that the button is pressed just to continue. If you get a keyboard that feels better for you, you're gonna feel more comfortable typing on it, therefore you will type faster. The more comfortable the feeling, the more natural the feeling, the faster you're gonna type. A keyboard you choose yourself will actually help you type faster. And of course, if businesses out there can actually heed this warning that an employee would be more effective having their own keyboard, you may very well have a lot more effective employees using their own keyboard since most keyboards won't cause any issues to your computers anyway. Now, besides that, some of you are gonna be wondering, does wired or wireless matter? No. The angle counts, the stability of the keyboard counts, so it has to be a keyboard that is stable on the counter that doesn't slide around, otherwise you will constantly make mistakes. But you should try out as many keyboards as possible. My favorite way of trying things out is by going to an office supply store. Get every single keyboard you can get your hand on and start typing like crazy. Feel it, hear it, and best of all, enjoy it. The keyboard you like the best, the one that feels the best for you, is the one that you should get yourself. And remember, keyboard that feels natural and comfortable more or equal to 90 degrees and no wrist rest, typingweb.com for all of you teachers and students, and keybr.com for those like me who want to either better or get better at typing, and you will type plenty fast enough. Now, of course, this episode couldn't be made possible except for the gracious sponsors like ProXPN that helped me out with this show. And I want you to remember that now more than ever, your online freedom and privacy are under threat. Governments and ISPs want to control everything you can or cannot see while keeping a detailed record of everything you do, plus that free Wi-Fi at the coffee house or airport terminal and soon planes is putting you at risk because your passwords and sensitive data can be easily intercepted more than you may have ever thought before. ProXPN is a global VPN that works with almost any internet connection. It creates a secure encrypted tunnel to which all your online data passes back and forth. Any online application can work with ProXPN, including your web browser, email file sharing, and instant messaging programs. ProXPN keeps everything you do online hidden from prying eyes, disguising your physical location, and giving you unfeathered access to any website or online service on the internet, no matter where you live or travel to. Complete online privacy with 2048-bit encryption and a 512-bit encryption tunnel, meaning nobody can see the traffic inside whatsoever. Compl works with OpenVPN, which is what they're based on, and PPTP for devices that don't have access to OpenVPN. You get to choose. Protects you from the ISP six strikes rule, internet filtering, blocked websites, geographical restrictions with internet content and online videos available through worldwide service in the US, UK, Asia, and more, and has software for Windows and Mac. So both of you 
offering advanced controls allowing you to select the programs and ports you want to anonymously route through ProXP on servers. For those who want to access videos in a different country and still nuke noobs in Steam, you get to pick which applications go over their ports and which ones pass locally for the best ping speed. And also works with iOS and Android now with their own applications on both allowing you to use your data plan or public corporate Wi-Fi with complete and total privacy on the go. Of course, you can always use PPTP if you absolutely wanted to, even though it's less secure. And they boast one of the best 24-7 customer supports. Now to help out the show, all you need to do is to go to proxpn.com slash podcast for more information and to sign up. TQA Weekly watchers and listeners... Also get a free 30-day risk-free trial. Remember to go to proxpn.com slash podcast, sign up with the coupon code TQA week, uh, TQAWEE, and enjoy the benefits of premium accounts for less because premium accounts are normally $9.95 a month or $74.95 for the entire year. We have a special offer for you. Use the coupon code TQAWEE and you will receive 20% off for the lifetime of your account. So if you're paying for the entire year in one shot, you'll be paying less than $5 per month. Thank you for watching the show. I hope it helped you all out. Remember to subscribe if you already haven't and have a great day. Goodbye. Thank you for listening to TQA Weekly. Show your support by liking this episode, subscribe to get our latest episodes as they come out, and share with friends and family who may benefit from such a show as this. You may send us your questions, comments, suggestions, and or stories to ask at tqaweekly.com. For our show notes, links to our Android application, alternate means of subscribing to our show, and information on joining our weekly newsletter, head over to tqaweekly.com. Stay safe and online, and have a great day.